All right, so let's break that down because break you just down. pissed me off. So now that we're about a half hour into this episode, let's start oh the gosh. episode. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm starting to sweat. I'm starting to sweat a little bit. Like, this is stressing me out, and I don't even have a business that you're a karate guy. Um, <laughs> never knew that. And I, yeah, to man. be just straight up honest, once I met you, I was like, there's no way this guy's a karate guy. <laughs> but you are. Is, is that 14? That is 14. Feels weird. Yeah. Uh, we don't do math on this show, so that enough of that. <laughs> enough of that. Do you make a, a graph out of how much whiskey we have we have had that show and how much we're willing to say yes to, to push all. the envelope. Yeah. <laughs> I used to go fade and then I just was like, dude, what are you doing? Like yeah, it was, it's not enough there. <laughs> right. Well, like I almost still felt like it was like an optical illusion, right? So it oh, made right. whatever was left. On top, look a little, yeah, look a little fuller. I had a pit fire and burnt that son of a bitch. I almost burned my house down. What's normal temperature? In the winter, it's seventy. I'd be sweating. Personally. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, well, this, is a, this must be a white people thing because I don't have the time for it. I really don't. Yeah. He has it at sixty degrees. I, I, I am sixty. Yes. You're a bald man, and you know, <laughs> the that's not exactly like. You know, the, the, the as a bald man, I understand what you're saying. Yeah. He always throws the bus with me. It, it's so he, good. He, he gets the sweaty pits. Yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy today we got this <laughs> this shirt on top because <laughs> nobody can see the sweaty pits. Busy night, but I would not miss Mike's podcast birthday party. Scotch in hand, ready to go. This is exciting. We got naked, climbed on the third story of the building. He was throwing bottles naked on top of the third story of a oh row home God. towards ongoing traffic. I think that people, if they weren't really paying attention during that answer, like they missed a key thing that that was you were talking to the cow. So... <laughs> Tell, tell me about that. I, I don't even know how to ask that, ask that question any other way. Tell me about that. We had more yard sales than any family in the face of the world should ever f***ing have. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, we're that family, like, on the block. Yeah, Every right. other weekend, we're having a yard sale. I'm like, where does this shit come from? I'm looking at the cameras. I'm like, oh, so I see you guys are using diffusing me. Well, you can tell the producer's like, yeah, but it's like 1030. We want to get your story. And they're like, Shut yeah. Shut yeah, up yeah, and just sing. Right, right. <laughs> it's I symbolic. Know. I don't know. <laughs> See, I, I would be it. one of these nitpicky clients. Like, I'm fine. getting free advice on my show <laughs> from you, and I'm being nitpicky. That generally doesn't happen to me, and I'll explain why. Because you're the best, obviously. Well, no, Next I question. mean, obviously. That, that was a good <laughs> Right. That was the softball part of the question. <laughs> oh, man, that was so great. Great, great. That was so awesome. Boy, everybody <laughs> strapped in. <laughs>